Hello and welcome to the Rebub Room, my name is Thomas and today we are back with another Studio Ghibli reaction, this time uh, when Marnie was uh, was there. Um, this is made in 2014, uh, so it's actually the newest one we've watched so far, um, and quite coincidentally it was clashing with Castle in the Sky, which would have been the oldest one that we would have watched so far. So yeah, when Marnie was there and Castle in the Sky, they were they were basically neck and neck, so I kind of got to choose in the end. So hopefully I've made the right decision and you guys aren't going to hate me for it. But to be honest, in the end, the only reason I went for when Marnie was there is just because it's about half an hour shorter and I don't have too much time at the moment. Um, and sorry that the videos have been... Um, well, it's been about a month since the last Studio Ghibli reaction. I've just had a lot of uni work, so I haven't really gotten around to doing it. But I hopefully uh, won't have as big of a gap for the next one. So. For the next one, maybe expect two weeks, something like that. Um, but yeah, I don't really know what to expect with when Marnie was there. Um, I don't really watch the trailers for them. I just kind of see what Netflix shows me at the, the little picture and that's it. Uh, and then I jump straight into it. But for the other reactions, uh, what we, <laughs> there's quite a lot of recommendations. So I've got a little, uh, little list here. Um, so we have Nausicaa, Totoro, um, Ponyo, Arietti, Arietti, um, When Marnie Was There, which we're doing now, Castle in the Sky, Whisper of the Heart, Princess Kaguya, uh, Grave of the Fireflies, uh, which is another quite popular one, but it's just behind Castle in the Sky. And uh, there was another one that I've got to write down. So I will write that down and add it to the list, but do keep uh, commenting down your recommendations, because I do put them on the list and kind of uh, give them a little tally if you can see that. And uh, yeah, there's been quite a few, uh, quite a few events actually, which is kind of nice and a bit surprising <laughs> to be honest. Um, but um, yeah, let's get into it. But just before we do, I would like to say if you are new, maybe do consider subscribing and do leave a like if you do like it. If you don't like it, leave a dislike. Uh, but also maybe just tell me why. Uh, and uh, yeah, let's get into it. So in three, two, one, let's react. So I left home. I packed up and I moved. Far away from my past one day And I left, I left, I left Okay then, so uh, yeah, that, that movie at the end was that, that hit, that hit at the end. Um, I literally just finished watching, I literally just took it off now. And uh, yeah, whoa, the ending, that was... That was a really feel good ending, like a really feel good ending. At, to, like about 10 minutes before the end, I was thinking it's a good movie, but it's not it's not quite there with um, Spirited Away and How's Moving Castle and uh, Princess Mononoke. But the last fight, even just the last, that kind of almost last line where she calls uh, Yoriko her mum, oh, that really, that really hit me. Um, oh, wow. Yeah, that was that was good. That was a good movie. I like this this one as well. Um, oh, it, it just for Marnie to turn out to be a grandmother, and that's how she how she had like this faint recognition of the house, like she'd been there before, and then the song as well. It, it all comes together and kind of makes sense. Um, I mean, seeing her grandmother uh, Marnie when she's uh, little, I, was she a ghost then, or was she just I don't know something of her imagination? I really don't know. You guys are going to have to probably uh, tell me that in the comments. Um, it's also great that she that she made like that real friend through the connection with her grandmother, which which is really nice for for Marnie. And then even when she was leaving, you saw that she you know she came to know and uh, be friendly with quite a lot of people. Even the even the uh, even the girl that she told us a fat pig. <laughs> Uh, which that part escalated quite quickly. Um, yeah, it does look like they could possibly be friends, and she's going to go back next summer, and it's uh, yeah, it's going to be a good time for her. Um, so yeah, she has a lot to look forward to in the summer now, which is which is awesome. And the uh, other friends, uh, the ones she's going to write letters to, um, that's yeah, it's 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 just a really good story of her kind of development uh, from this kind of almost emotionless girl to now she's she's back full of life and happy again so it's really nice to see but yeah there's a, this is a really good movie I'm gonna 
um, link the playlist for all the other Studio Ghibli movies if you want to go watch that if you haven't already uh, here or there I can't remember which direction it comes in um, but yeah oh, I'm gonna have to take a moment for this for this movie this this was really good I um, I'm happy I went with it in the end to be honest I'm really happy I went with it and uh, yeah, do make sure you uh, leave a comment for what you want me to watch next and make sure uh, you comment if I've missed anything as well and uh, your thoughts on the movie and uh, do leave a like if you did like it, uh, leave a dislike if you didn't like it and uh, I'll see you in the next one which hopefully won't be as long as it took uh, for this one to come out <laughs> but uh, yeah, that's all from me I think, so goodbye and ciao ciao So I left home, 